perfect. What's going on everybody? You are watching Angling Anarchy. My name is Brian. I am attempting to catch pike today and not being very successful at it. I did get one, so I guess we can at least watch the one that I caught. There's a fish. There we go. Not big, but I will take it. Nice, nice. Yeah, 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 I know, I know. Let go, there we go. Now, a lot of the other fish I had come in had these marks on them too, and I can't, I can't quite tell what, what that's from. But anyway, got ourselves a pike, first one on the boat. So, off and running. All right, so that's it, a little guy. Uh, I guess better than nothing. It's, it's nice to get out um, in these days when it is tough to get out. A lot of states are closing down boat launches and it's, uh, it's just a, a sad time right now. Uh, luckily in Wisconsin we can still get out so I've been trying to fish here and there but today just was not my day. So what we're going to do is take a look back at some really old footage. It's probably five or six years old. It's um, when I first one of the first couple of years I started filming uh, musky fishing. We were up in Canada, up in Ontario, at uh, one of my favorite places in the world to be, uh, at Cole Grove's Eagle Lake Lodge. And Jim, who I fish with quite a bit, his personal best musky up to this point was a 40 and a half incher, I think. And he gets an absolute giant. It's a 48 and a half inch fish. He gets on a, a Esox Assault double eight bucktail. Um, and yeah, let's let's take a, let's watch it. Let's see if I can edit this together in such a way that it's uh, interesting. Because you know this was back before I was wearing a chest cam. The audio is probably kind of crappy. So uh, let's see what we can do with this and watch Jim catch this big uh, 48 and a half inch musky. coming in this direction here. Huh? Just get her coming in this direction here. I wish I could have taken it there. Coming in. Yep, yep. Jeez, 
Oh, Jim. That's that's a big fish. Oh, that's a big fish. <laughs> I shouldn't be looking at him having a heart attack. Where'd he hit? Right, right out here. Right, no just, kidding. Right six feet off from the boat. Get us going. Right. Correction, Dave. <laughs> oh, fuck. Just kidding. As a song. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my own. Woo. That's an upper 40s, I think. Whew. It's got to be darn close. Trouble. <laughs> 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 uh, well, I just saw I knew it was a good sized fish. Oh. That son of fear, and then it just was off to the freaking races. <sighs> okay, we're gonna drift into a rock here, so you wanna hold on to this tape. I'm just gonna get this going away from oh. it. Oh. Alright, that, that broke the skunk for today. I never would have thought of casting back in this <laughs> one because there's usually, I mean, there's, there's some good weeds right here. So. Yeah. Well, it's, I snagged the first one and then I threw again and bam. I just went right on it there. No, no <laughs> I hardly do anything but duck. <laughs> Alright, luckily he was hooked good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, you gotta, you gotta turn off this camera or put it back on the So that was a, that was a cool fish. Um, I think this was from the same trip. I'm not quite sure, but I just I, I remember this fish very vividly. Jim hooks a, a smaller muskie right next to the boat, and it tries really really hard to jump in the boat with us. I feel like I, I felt like I was being attacked. Um, in fact, I think I, I jumped back like that when uh, I saw the fish come out of the water, and it, it was so close to being in the boat. If it would have gotten another half foot higher, it was actually I think it bumps against the boat. Um, but we got some pretty cool footage of that, so we'll watch that one now. Everybody, thank you so much for watching um, yeah I really wish we could have put some fish in the boat today but next best thing was to take a look at some old footage that I had uh, back in the old days when I just I didn't have quite the gear that I have now so uh, hopefully this turned out okay and uh, hopefully you enjoyed it if you did enjoy this let me know in the comments uh, I do have a lot of this older type of footage that we can play around with and see what we can uh, do with it other than that, I'm just hoping for some warm weather. I'm hoping to keep the boat launches in Wisconsin open here so I can continue to get out and fish every now and again. And everybody, please stay safe, stay healthy. Uh, let's get through this thing and uh, get back to normal. I guess whatever normal is going to be from here on out. But yeah, thanks for watching, everybody. I'm out. We'll see you in the next video.